film freaks, Art Fern here today with today's fabulous film find. Joy Bishop, Bishop Sheen, Russell Mean, Bobby Breen, Santa Burger, Chief Justice Burger, and Wiener the Wonder Dachshund and Godzilla Streaks Pittsburgh. But first, friends, are you tired of tourist traps? Tired of the crunchy people at the usual tourist attractions? This year, try the unusual. Try the vacation tour of Trans Mountain Slide Airlines. That's right, friends. At Crown Mountainside, we don't think about mountains until the matinee lady comes around. <laughs> Hello there, my dear. Hello. Does Trans Mountain Slide Airlines have a slogan? That's Trans Mountain Side. Oh, some slide. Yes, they do have a slogan. Fly Trans Mountain Side. We break our tail for you. <laughs> then there's something to do with your tail. Yes, and now you know where to find me. On Trans Mountain Side, we don't go, friends, to those crowded cities. We go to the clear country fields because that's where we have to land, in country fields. We don't have those long lines of customs. In fields, there are no customs. In my whole life, I have never smuggled anything through customs. Now would you know, friends... <laughs> Friends, we don't take you to those ordinary, we don't take you to those ordinary corny tourist attractions. We take you to see the changing of the guards, but not in front of the palace. We take you to their locker room and let you see the changing of the guards' underwear. <laughs> we don't take you to the Bolshoi Ballet, but we'll take you to a ballet that'll make you want to holler, Bolshoi! <laughs> Yes, friends, we'll go to the Berlin Wall where we're staging a celebrity handball tournament. <laughs> and you'll be thrilled in Germany when we make a rest stop and you can change the color of the blue Danube. <laughs> and friends, that's right. That's right, friends, and we'll buzz, we buzz the low countries. Why? Because the countries we take you to are the lowest. <laughs> and we'll show you two of the seven hills of Rome. Are there seven hills of Rome? Not when you are there. We'll take you to a youth hostel where you'll meet some hostile youth. We won't be corny and take you to Beethoven's birthplace. We will take you to Beethoven's ear doctor's birthplace and show you why Beethoven's favorite word was, huh? And friends, here's a little tip to you bachelors. Bring candy and silk stockings. They still work. <laughs> I'll tell you later. Friends fly Trans Mountain Side Airlines where you fly now and you pay during the flight home or we don't land. <laughs> yes, you can pick up our tickets at our office here in town. How do you get there, you ask? You take the Ventura Freeway. <laughs> in this freeway, change to this freeway, come to the sloss and cut off, stop the car, cut off your sloss, and that's right. <laughs> get back in the car. Get back in the car and look for the firemen sifting through the wreckage of Trans Mountain Side Airlines. <laughs> now back to our flick. Richard Lou, Anita Lou, Lou Ayers, Lou Rawls, and Sheep the Wonder Cat in the four horsemen break a cheerleader's pom pom. <laughs> oh, we're back already. That was a beauty. J. Arthur Rank, J. Fred Mux, H. Arnhold Smith, L. Patrick Gray, and the Morbin Tabernacle Choir, and the Wolfman gets a vasectomy. But first, friends. <laughs> friends, are you grossly overweight? Are you taller lying down than standing up? <laughs> are you so fat you have to be airlifted out of bed? <laughs> when you're alone, are you arrested for unlawful assembly? <laughs> are you so fat you have to put shock absorbers on your toilet seat? Friends... <laughs> My friends... We have the answer. Come to Camp Lardaway. <laughs> Yes, at Camp Lardaway, you lose weight because to kill appetites, we show you the exorcist before a meal. <laughs> and our food stinks. We only serve food Yule Gibbons has rejected. <laughs> we provide each camper with a t-shirt and a tent, which are one and the same. <laughs> Movies are shown on a camper's stomach. At Camp Lardaway, only one camper fits in the lake at one time, but a second camper may be the raft. I've never seen a person be used as a raft. You will later. Yes, friends. <laughs> We rough it. We take you out of camp on a pulley from a helicopter and drop you in the woods. Then we charbroil a hamburger and we see if you can smell your way back to camp. <laughs> and while in the woods, friends, you can learn from the animals. Think of it. When have you seen a pudgy deer or a fat fox? <laughs> eat like they do. Chase down a rabbit and eat the carcass. The only bad side effect from this is rabbit breath. I once killed a rabbit. I beg your pardon? I once killed a rabbit. I'm hip at Camp Lardaway, friends. <laughs> We have sports like sweating, crying for food, and the pudgy fold game where you sit around and guess each other's sex. But don't... That's right, friends. That is true. That's fat. But don't you do anything nice to them? 
I'd like to do something nice to you. Friends, if you're good, if you're good, we give you a treat. We let you feel mayonnaise. Oh, you Yes, of course you do. If you're bad, we make you write 500 times on the blackboard. I have a defective thyroid gland. I don't know that gland. Never mind, as long as you know the rest of them. Now, fatties, at Camp Lardaway, we put on a show and sing songs like Roll Out My Sister, the bunkhouse song. Big Arnold keeps falling on my head, and if he ain't heavy, he ain't my brother. Fat people sound cute. I can't wait, wait to meet one. Well, be careful, my dear. If a fat man gets a crush on you, he gets a crush on you. Friends, we're looking for sad fatties. If someone has to come up to you and ask, where's your bike, and you answer, I'm sitting on it, <laughs> we want you. Camp Lardaway, how do you get there? I hear someone ask. Well, what you do? You take the harbor freeway to any harbor. Take a left at one freeway onto another freeway until you come to the fork in the road. <laughs> That's right, friends. You keep going up any mountain until you come to Camp Lardaway. Now back to our flick. Robert Stack, Roberta Flack, Jesse White, and Karen Black, and King Arthur hurts himself on a chastity belt. <laughs> Oh, back already. And that was another film first. Arthur Kennedy, George Kennedy, Ken Maynard, Maynard Ferguson, Bozo the Clown, and the Chancellor of Austria in Nanny and the Professor get arrested on a goat farm. But first, friends... <laughs> friends, have you ever... Have you ever looked at a product on TV and said, I thought of that? Well, come to us with your idea and you'll see your product on TV and you'll still say, I thought of that. But we will have a contract giving us 99% of the royalties and we'll say, right... But we thought of this. <laughs> yes, Timmy, Zach, now get your invention idea to us and you'll soon have extra cash for the racetrack. Be smart, we tell you how to market your invention. If you invent a flushing device, we put you up with the toilet people. If you invent a new pizza product, we show you where Italy is. Just contact our organization, Shaft U Corporation. <laughs> and here's our mad night lady to show you why you should invent something. Just take a look at some of these inventions we have marketed. Thank you, matinee lady. Oh, for willing this off? No, for letting me frisk you beforehand. Hmm. Did you find anything? More than I or a dozen sailors can handle. Now, see this, friends. <laughs> these are some of the inventions Shaft U Corporation has put on the market. What is this, you ask? A miniature tarpaulin you can roll down over your toupee if it rains. <laughs> Here, friends, another invention from Shaft U Corporation. What is this, you ask? Well, these are holsters for spray perspiration protection. <laughs> fit under your shirt and any time you need it you just flap your arms and poof you smell like a flower shop you just go no not you you'll snap something now how about this one friends what do we have here yes a burglar alarm for pantyhose <laughs> and here friends is the off switch in case you run into a friend I, I don't wear any I beg your pardon I don't wear then put any. the alarm wherever you wish friends Another big invention, curb feelers for your shoes, especially for drunks. <laughs> Here we have a great item, friends, to wear on free beer night in Cleveland. <laughs> That's right, a cat pistol. Very good if you're playing center field. And here, friends, is my favorite invention, non-skid cheese. <laughs> and here, friends, another fantastic unusual invention. Fantastic invention, friends, an iron lung for goldfish. <laughs> and here, one of the more fantastic products. This can cure 250,000 cases of hemorrhoids in one second. That's right, Preparation H-Bomb. Now, friends, <laughs> another success story. A raincoat with aluminum foil for flashers who want to tan. <laughs> friends, for all of you who want to tan for harp sire, you read a success story, the microwave tan right over here. You step in this door and in seconds you come out looking bronze and beautiful. I shall demonstrate. Matinee lady, when I get inside, set the timer for exactly three seconds. Do you understand? One, two, three. That's right. Seven is my lucky number. I hope it's his too. <laughs> Because, and I hope it, America will love this. <laughs> I'm gonna go now, tune in tomorrow for another boogie. I know.